Hello everyone, welcome to the Only Office webinar. I'm Julia from Medienstürmer, your host for today. Version 3.0 of Only Office DocSpace is now available with multiple enhancements. Would you like to explore the release closer? I will gladly guide you. Only Office DocSpace is intended to improve collaboration on Office documents and other content with various people you need to interact with on a daily basis, such as your colleagues, teammates, customers, partners, contractors, sponsors, etc. The platform provides a room-based environment for organizing a clear file structure depending on your needs or project goals. Flexible access permissions and user roles allow you to fine-tune the access to the whole space or separate rooms. The latest update of OnlyOffice DocSpace comes with more than 25 new features and improvements. Version 3.0 is already available in the cloud. The self-hosted build for Linux and Windows will be updated shortly. Let's learn about all the novelties. Only Office DocSpace 3.0 brings polished user management. First of all, the account section has now been named Contacts and contains a new tab, Guests. All this is connected with the updated user types and roles, which we are going to explore on later slides. And the reason for doing so is to make the process of managing users more intuitive, transparent and even more cost-efficient for you. So, the user types in DocSpace now include DocSpace Owner, DocSpace Admin, Room Admin, User and Guest. Each type defines which access a user has to different DocSpace sections and which actions they can make. The DocSpace owner obviously manages everything, including DocSpace deletion and payment details. DocSpace owners can see all rooms, archive them and invite new users. However, inside the rooms, owners can only perform actions according to the role for which they are invited to this or that room. DocSpace admins have access to the DocSpace settings and again they can see all rooms but are only able to edit files in rooms to which they were invited. Room admins can create new rooms and manage the assigned ones, invite new users and assign permission levels but only below their level. That means that room admins are not able to invite for example DocSpace admins. Actually, this rule refers to each type of users who have the right to invite new users. In DocSpace 3.0, the power user type became user and what's important, it's now a free account. So it's possible to add an unlimited number of users without any fee. Users can Create and edit files in the room, but can create rooms, manage users or access settings. Invite guests to a room with confirmation by the room manager and also like DocSpace owner, DocSpace admins or room admins, they have the documents section for storing and managing personal files. So welcome the new guest type. Like the users type, it's a free type. Guests can be invited via rooms only. This way, they have access only to the rooms they are invited to. We also would like to highlight that each user has their own list of invited guests, which is available to them via the corresponding tab in the contact section. Guests don't have access to the contacts and documents sections and can create their own rooms. So what is it guests can do? Depending on the given role within the room, they can do various actions with files and folders such as view only, edit, create, etc. Guests can also invite other guests to a room with a confirmation by the room manager. The contacts they invite will be added to the guest contact sections in the manager administrator who confirmed their addition to the room. Speaking about user roles in Rooms, you will also find two new types, Room Manager and Content Creator. Along with the roles of Editor, Form Filler, Reviewer, Commenter and Viewer. Admins can assign a permission level to a user within a certain room. 
Each room type comprises different permission levels which can be assigned to its members. For public rooms, it's room manager and content creator. For form filling rooms, it's room manager, content creator and form filler. For collaboration and virtual data rooms alike, room manager, content creator, editor and viewer. For custom rooms, all roles are available. And what actions can users perform depending on the given role? I guess it's pretty clear with the role of editor, form filler, reviewer, commenter and viewer. As for content creators, they can work with documents depending on the room type, create and upload new files and folders and also manage version history. And room managers are also able to copy, rename, move and remove own and someone else's files and folders. Another addition to the user management is support for OAuth 2. It can be activated via the Developer Tools section and applied for user authorizations and further actions like access to files. Let's move on to the next section. The latest DocSpace updates brings another room type with several useful features for room management. Welcome the first version of virtual data rooms for advanced file security and transparency. You can use it for secure storing and sharing of confidential business information. VDRs are commonly used by businesses for due diligence and when they are merging, working on a project or other joint venture that requires access to shared data. Here you are able to automatically index and track all content to keep great records and stay organized. Enable watermarks, set file lifetime as well as restrict downloading and copying. Let's see how it works. We go to the Rooms section and create a new virtual data room, setting the required name, tags and icon. Here we also define all the settings. Automatic indexing, file lifetime, let's set for example that files older than 3 months will be removed to trash, copy and download restriction, Watermarks, it can be viewer into image or we can also adjust its scrolling and rotation. So the settings are all ready and we click create. Let's imagine we already have a folder with several documents in our room. Since automatic indexing is enabled, all the files and folders are indexed by serial number. If any file is deleted or moved, the indexes are kept for other files and if needed, we can apply the reorder option to fill in the gaps. What else? We can use the export room index option to generate a summary report on the room file structure. If we have set the copy and download restrictions, users with the fewer role will be not able to perform these actions within the document. If we have set watermark protection, in our case it's viewer info, the document will contain the watermark type which can't be deleted or replaced. Further improvements for DocSpace rooms include ability to share public rooms for editing, reviewing and commenting. This way external users with whom you share your public room can not only view the room contents but also perform the corresponding actions depending on the given permission. Besides, it's now possible to set a custom logo for the room by selecting the needed color or icon for the room cover. Several improvements are also made for more convenient file management. Thus, you can decide whether to display the file extensions next to the file name or not by configuring this setting via your profile, File Management. Moreover, it's now possible to convert XML files to DOCX or XLSX for viewing and editing. Well, which new features do you like the most? The latest update is already available for only Office DocSpace Cloud. Sign in to your space to try all the new features yourself. 
or create a free account if you are new to only office doc space just scan the qr code and directly access the registration page however if you thought that this was already it it's not we have further news to share with you as many of you know, there are several ready-to-use integrations for only Office DocSpace, which allow using the platform together with other apps and services. Among those are integrations with Zoom, WordPress, Drupal. The recent added Zapier integration, which allows automating your workflow using Zaps for DocSpace and various apps like Asana, Slack, HubSpot, Discord, Trello, Gmail, Pipedrive, Zoom, etc. As well as integration with Pipedrive, which lets you work with Office files related to your Pipedrive deals directly in DocSpace rooms. And now it will be easier than ever to integrate DocSpace into your own web app or another solution. Welcome the build of only Office DocSpace developer. Curious to learn more? We'll do it right away, stay tuned. Well, we are moving to the next part of our webinar where we will tell you everything you want to know about only Office DocSpace developer. Let's go! What is OnlyOffice DocSpace Developer actually? It is a commercial build of the open source solution intended for integration into any commercial software under your own brand and on your own servers. OnlyOffice DocSpace Developer will suit you if you need to extend your own web app such as CMS project management, messaging, mail, etc. with a secure space for content storing and online collaboration. For example, if you have your own CRM system, integrate only Office DocSpace and you will get a ready solution for storing, managing and collaborating on documents along with customer and sales management all in one. If you do so, your end users will get a user-friendly and secure platform with various types of rooms to work on any content. Speaking about room types, here they are. Collaboration rooms to co-author docs, track changes and communicate in real time. Form filling rooms to organize straightforward form filling, collect and analyze responses. Public rooms to invite users via external links and allow them to view and work with documents without registration. Custom rooms where it's possible to apply your own settings and use these rooms for any custom purpose or scenario. And also the newly added virtual data rooms for advanced file security and transparency. In only Office DocSpace, your end users are able to work with any electronic content, including text documents, sheets, slides, PDF and PDF forms, markdown files, ebooks, and multimedia. With only Office DocSpace, sensitive and confidential data always stays protected thanks to GDPR compliance and encryption, various options for documents access and login control. Only Office DocSpace provides an economic interface with an intuitive navigation across rooms and settings. UI tweaks, hotkeys, special plugins, etc. let DocSpace accommodate users with special needs. And what are the benefits for developers? Let's find out. Only Office DocSpace developer seamlessly fits any web app no matter what language it is written in or what framework it is based on. It also doesn't matter what deployment model you use. You can integrate DocSpace into your SAS or on-premises solution. To customize the platform and deliver it under your own brand, the option of standard branding or white label are provided by choice in the DocSpace developer build. Next, you get useful developer tools including access to Open API, JavaScript SDK to easily embed the whole DocSpace 
or its part into your web interface, which comprises the ready embedding presets and custom mode and plugins SDK to build and connect your own plugins to the platform. This way, it's possible to add any extra functionality. Among the ready-to-use plugins, there are Markdown, Speech-to-Text, Draw.io, and PDF Converter. The developer tools also provide webhooks to perform custom actions on the site of any application or website you are using based on various events in DocSpace. As well as OAuth 2 for user authorizations and further actions like access to files. It's important to know that there are already several integrations of DocSpace with different services Zoom, WordPress, Drupal, Pipedrive, and Zapier. You can use these as ready integration examples. In the Zoom and DocSpace integration, based on C Sharp, HTML, and CSS, DocSpace is embedded directly into Zoom meetings for real time doc collaboration. The integration of WordPress and DocSpace based on PHP, JavaScript, and CSS allows adding DocSpace rooms or files to the WordPress pages. The similar approach and programming languages are used in the DocSpace and Drupal integration. In the next example, it's possible to work with Office files related to Pipedrive deals directly in DocSpace rooms. Yet another example is Zapier. Here, special apps called Zaps connect to DocSpace and various apps like Asana, Slack, HubSpot, Discord, Trello, Gmail, Pipedrive, Zoom, etc. Only Office DocSpace developer is delivered as Docker, DEB, and RPM packages for Linux and EXE package for Windows. The Kubernetes build allows running it in cluster. If we speak about licensing, we should mention that you get a cost-effective solution tailored to any budget. If you are planning to use only Office Doc Space for development at first or for internal testing with your system, opt for the corresponding plan with 20 simultaneous connections. Then, when you are ready to use DocSpace for production to provide it to your end users, you can choose among various plans of 250, 500, 1000 or even more simultaneous connections and three support levels, as well as add additional options such as multi-tenancy, multi-server, support for disaster recovery training courses. So, ready to give it a try? Scan the QR code on the slide and go to the download page to start your free trial. Or contact the OnlyOffice team directly via sales at onlyoffice.com to get a free demo and discuss all the details. Thank you for joining the webinar. Stay safe. Bye.